Can you see my uh, slide? Okay, uh, my name is Nope Paban and uh, neurosurgeon of, uh, sorry, uh, neurosurgeon uh, head of spine department of Grand Med Hospital, Mongolia. So my topic is about outcome of lateral resistance with PSLD. So uh, I think it's uh, all of familiar in this topic. So um, in 500 years ago, people thought that sun turns to earth, but uh, Copernicus proved earth turns to time. So uh, this is a good example of paradigm chip. So endoscopic decompression also has so paradigm chip example, good example. So uh, uh, between three, three years, I performed almost 700 cases. So 250 cases of them was stenosis and I performed endoscopic deep compression. Uh, uh, so uh, I would like to introduce my results of my case. So we studied uh, 100 cases and the uh, mean age of them was 64.4. Mean operation time was 33 minutes. Mean hospital stay was 2.2 days. And the kennel volume changed uh, 47%. And the bus score, ODI, uh, changed like that. And patient satisfaction rate was uh, 80, 96%. So, uh, so I would like to share with you what we have learned uh, after 700 cases. Actually, in practice, it is easy to diagnose lateral resistenosis from MRI on sagittal view and axial view. We can diagnose easily. But unfortunately, we compute sometimes uh, in like this case. So in sagittal view and axial view, it's difficult to say lateral resistenosis. In practice, such case, it's hard to make decision, operation, I mean, operation decisions. So, uh, uh, so we know that nerve root located, not straight, so root located diagonally. So by the formal MRI, I mean, uh, axial, View cut only at the disc level, we able to see a small part of the nerve root. So it's difficult to make final decision. If you want to see lateral recess pool, we have to uh, MRI axial view widely. And so uh, uh, like this composite case, in my practice, clinical practice, I will follow the nerve root, not after from down. I uh, I follow the nerve root down to up. So uh, I am first I I am point uh, pedicle and then follow the nerve root like this up down to up. So. Uh, it's helped me to diagnose lateral laces uh, clearly. So uh, <clears throat> finally, it's my key point. In the axial view, we can see pedicle. And next to pedicle, located nerve root. Uh, so if you magnify nerve root compressed by the, in this case, by the ligamentum plebum. Uh, in this next axial view, nerve root, Located here, and uh, if magnified, compressed by SAP, I mean uh, by the bone. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is an uh, operation case, for example, pre-op and post-op. You can see uh, uh, nerve root, the room, uh, uh, ligament problem totally removed in this case. Um, <coughs> from this slide, which nerve 
compressed by SIP, post operator report decompressed SIP, and uh, this line is uh, entry point of scope. So uh, we can small remove lamina and we can achieve full decompression. So I think uniportal scope can make such achievement from small entry point and uh, full achievement. So this is my operation uh, video. So uh, <clears throat> we start like this, and as you know that, so uh, uh, we are starting bone drilling and um, we are trying to step by step and uh, removing bone and ligamentum flavum and like that. This patient was a very old patient, so really uh, hypertrophic uh, ligamentum flavum. So uh, step by step, we are removing uh, ligamentum flavum and go ahead and going, going, going. So um, in this video, I would like to show how to remove SAP and uh, this is, I am trying to remove ligamentum plebum uh, under of SAP. And, uh, and so such case, uh, usually in uniportal case, removing that part, bleeding too much. So it's difficult to sometimes controlling bleeding control. So I usually uh, try to nerve roots gently uh, retract by the um, dissector, uh, retract smoothly because I try to uh, release of uh, scar tissues. And uh, I prepared, I recorded this video for uh, this slide, so I cleared like that. Uh, otherwise, I am not clearing uh, such bone and uh, head and scar tissues. And uh, I want to show in this uh, in this biting is important because this is biting of SIP, and so it makes me clear and. Uh, this is also important. Mm -hmm. So other sometimes I am using like that. And uh, I want to show uh, like this, for example, in this case, I am clearing uh, for demonstration. Otherwise, I am not clean tissues. So thank you so much for your attentions. And this is by Mongolian language, by Allah. <laughs>